Students in the Atascadero Unified School District are petitioning to recall two board members after they made what some are calling racially charged comments about mask mandates. KSBY's Claudia Busio shows us what happened in Tuesday's board meeting. Students launched a petition through Change.org asking for the resignation of two school board members. So far, more than 260 people have signed this petition. Parents and grandparents still divided on whether mask mandates should remain at schools. It's uh, comfortable if in, in, inside a school. So when you can't even see a person's face because they're masked, that sort of messes with their social development. I just think that everyone should just respect and if people want to wear masks, let them wear a mask. And if they don't want, that's their decision. Multiple heated exchanges took place during the Atascadero Unified School Board meeting on Tuesday. Call your legislatures, call your governor, make your voices heard where it's going to matter. Parents accusing school officials of allegedly mistreating their kids for not wearing masks. Still being marked absent. School board member Ray Bubin was shocked and said he was under the impression that the superintendent was handling the situation. The following comment stirred more fuel by comparing this to segregation. That your children are no longer being segregated, disrespected, and treated like third class citizens or someone that should be sitting at the back of the bus. School board member Terry Switzer also made remarks that upset some in attendance. I was denied access into Sierra Vista Hospital yesterday to see a family member that will probably never see sunshine again. Because like the Holocaust, I could not prove if I was a German or a Jew. Oh, I mean my vaccine status. Following the meeting, students launched a change.org petition on Instagram. The anonymous student-run account AHS Do Better is calling out these board members asking Bubin to not compare segregated African Americans with anti-mask protesters. In a post, they said, quote, wearing a mask is a choice. Being black is not. It's probably not the place, but then you don't, you just can't, you know, um, eliminate somebody just because they said something you don't like. My thoughts is you can't compare COVID-19 with stuff like that. We reached out to both school board members and also to the superintendent, but none of them have issued a response just yet. In Atascadero, Claudia Busio, KSBY News. The mask mandate at schools and child care settings issued by the California Department of Public Health ends on March 11th.